We are to find the value of x in this diagram given that O is the center. If O is the center, it means that AC is the diameter. And if AC is the diameter, that means you are going to be having a semicircle. Now, if you look at angle ABC, angle ABC based on our knowledge is equal to 90 degrees because this is angle inscribed in a semicircle. So basically the whole of the angle here is 90 degrees. Now we can take it a step further by looking for angle C. If you look at triangle A C, B. You're going to see that the only missing part of that triangle is C. And so, angle A, C, B is equal to 180 degrees minus 30 plus 90 degrees. When you do that, you have 180 degrees minus 120 degrees, which is equal to 60 degrees. This is the sum of angles in a triangle. So we can mark this as 60. Remember that angle ACB and angle ADB, that is the angle here and the angle here, are both equal, which is equal to 60 degrees. The reason for that is they are angles in the same segment in the same segment right so this is equal to 60 degrees now to find x it is known that the exterior angle of a triangle is equal to the sum of the two interior opposite angles so which means that 105 degrees is equal to 60 degrees plus x so I can write that angle D E C is equal to angle D A C which we are looking for plus angle A D E or B. So one hundred and five degrees is equal to angle D A C which is X that we are looking for plus ADP that is 60 degrees. So angle DAC is equal to 105 degrees minus 60 degrees. Remember, the reason is because you have an exterior angle which is equal to the sum of two interior angles. So angle DAC. DAC is equal to 45. So which means X equals 45 degrees. Thank you.